Well, tonight, some people may be using their Christmas cash to make a unique addition to their households. News 12's Bayana Garland found out the reality of owning pets while at the Fantastic Fish and Pet Store in Kinston. The appeal of exotic pets have drawn holiday shoppers. From big reptiles to exotic birds, the variety is endless. But is the reality of owning these pets as glamorous as it seems? I talked to Ashley Owens, who works at Fantastic Fish and Pets and owns more exotic pets than anyone can count. She says many parents come in during the holidays to ask questions and try to get an idea of what they're actually getting into. She urges people to stay away from impulse buying. Exotic pets like bearded dragons, snakes, tarantulas need more than just food and water. This thing is cute and little now, but it is going to get bigger. You're like, hey, I've got this Christmas money. I want to do this. What does it take? And we show them the tanks and, you know, lighting and such like that. And just being aware that that's, that's what you're getting into long term. They're not going to stay small like, uh, like the baby bunnies. Everyone gets excited because they got this little bunny, but the bunny's going to grow and the bunny needs, you know, adequate space and time. For parents who want to buy a pet for their child, Ashley says that while the child may beg for one now, they could lose interest in the pet as they get older, leading the parent to be the main caretaker. Ashley recommends that everyone do their research on the good and the bad of owning these pets and to also be financially able to take care of them. In Lenore County, Billiana Garland, News 12.